Uh, that mandate and all the rules that go with it were sent out to school districts this afternoon, and it appears that most are welcoming it, framing him here one of more than 100 districts that already had a mask mandate in place. I'm totally in favor of it. I like it. I think that it will keep everyone safe. Masks will be part of the back to school supplies in Massachusetts. The state officially issuing a mandate for all students and staff at K through 12 schools. It's definitely difficult to meet new people and really like get to know everyone with something covering your face. So, um, but I'm just glad that we're wearing them just to keep everyone safe. The mandate includes some familiar rules. Masks are required indoors except when eating, drinking or during mask breaks. There are exemptions for medical or behavioral reasons and masks must be worn for indoor sports related activity. And the response from the membership has been generally very positive. The head of the Massachusetts Association of School Committee says more than 100 districts already enacted a mask mandate and the organization urged the state to take the lead. We wanted some consistency. This is one exception where we really did want the state to sort of take the lead. Doing the month of September seemed to be good public policy, uh, cautious public policy and not an overreaction. So masks will be required of everyone in schools until October 1st. Then middle and high schools that reach the 80% vaccination rate can unmask. However, the Commissioner of Education now has the authority to change that timeline. Live in Framingham, Sarah Conji, WCVB News Center 5. Sarah, thank you.